What's up everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel where we do behind the scenes videos and general photography chat. Uh, I'm in Scotland, we're on our way to Sky. We just passed in Morriston and I thought I'm not going to find a more beautiful start so early in our trip. So I thought I'd just uh, start my uh, video here. That's about it. Just got some shots on the phone here. What am I going to do in this video? We're traveling to Sky for a couple of days, Helen and I, and uh, I'm going to shoot a bit of landscape stuff and we're just going to see the scenery and everything that the Isle of Skye in the northwest of Scotland has to offer. Have a little time away for Christmas. So I'm going to clamber back up this hill and get on with driving. So we've got to the hotel. Helen is uh, giving her Heli Hansen its first outing. When did you buy that hill? About eight years ago. Eight years ago. <laughs> That's our hotel there. It's the Slugaken Hotel. Lunch. We just had lunch. I had haggis, neeps and tatties. Veggie haggis. Probably got an hour of light left. So we're going to go see what we can see. Got my camera. And uh, yeah, we're going to take a little walk. There's a few paths along here. There's some of the coolants in the background, I believe. I'm going to be shooting some landscapes. I've got a ND grad there. It's very harsh, that ND grad. It's either dark or bright. So maybe it needs to be of a longer gradient, I guess. I don't really use them, so I'm not too up to speed, but it's pretty handy. What are you mumbling about back there? Uh, I'm gonna film the whole thing on this new iPhone X, and I'm gonna shoot some pictures on it as well, and I'm gonna shoot some pictures on the 5D Mark IV. Morning vlog, it's Friday, it's Friday, and we've just had a full Scottish breakfast. We're gonna head out to the fairy pools in the sky today, um, which actually isn't too far from where we're staying in Slagakin. Very, well, it's supposed to be like crystal clear water. There's been a lot of snow and rain recently in Scotland, as always. So, be interested to see what the sort of rivers, and I think there's a little waterfall, what that might be like. Helen's giving it all the chat, thinking she's gonna go for a swim in it. It's gonna, it is mild, it is a mild 10 degrees today, but. If you dare me, I'll do it. She won't do it. <laughs> so, we're just on our way to the fairy pools, and Helen's never seen a Highland cow before. Quite a big set of ones, eh? Wow, it's amazing. <laughs> Has he looked up since you got he here? He hasn't, he doesn't care. <laughs> we're here at the fairy pools. It was so tricky getting here. The fog, as you can see, is insane. So we're going to get our hiking boots on. Let's get to these legendary fairy pools. Don't know if it's going to be ideal for any photography, but I don't know, the mist might add something. So we made it to the fairy pools. It's very misty. I think usually you can see the coolants in the background there. Crystal clear water running up the hill. Some people take a dip in them, but it's so cold. I don't think I'll be doing that today. We're gonna to maybe walk a little further up, see what else there is so we're not missing anything, and then walk down and get some pictures. So we've had a little explore around. The mist, as you can see, is clearing. There's also been a, a coach load of uh, visitors dropped off, which is all well and good. I guess we fall into that category as well. There's hell clambering around. We're just starting to see the mountains in the background there. I think we've got to the top of where most of the pools are. I think. Uh, we've got a couple other things that we want to try and do today. Get to the Old Manor store and also drive up the Quran. Um, so we're going to head back down now. Helen's doing a little vlog, I'll link that in the description. Uh, mystery really clear to drive now from sort of like middle of the island to the northwest coast of the store. And then just come up to Quran. Uh, visibility is so poor, it's a bit of a shame, but still a nice walk. Scramble over some rocks, some 
rivers, streams, it's not the best for pictures I'm afraid. Um, so we're going to walk along here, I'll maybe shoot some stuff on the phone and uh, I think we'll have time to at least take a little venture up the old man of store while we're in this thick of the woods. Man's hot house. It's 14 degrees. It's day three of our trip. Scorcho! Scorcho! 14 degrees. December. We're in Fort William, Ben Nevis. We're on our way to Glencoe. Um, maybe see the deer. Probably not do as much uh, <laughs> walking as last time. <laughs> I got a fright from a car in a car park. Hopefully, we see some deer. We've got some berries to feed them. Helen's really. Do you think people are going to be really annoyed if we feed them berries? No. You want to see deer? Photography wise, yesterday was a bit of a write off. So, well, I got some good pictures. Okay, we're just at the entrance, I guess, the northern entrance of Glencoe here. Nice little stop here. You get the clouds rolling through the mountains. Quite cloudy today, but could make for some epic pictures. I'm just gonna set up my camera as well. As you can hear, it's quite windy. I'm just gonna set up the camera so it's easy to jump in and out and get some pictures along the way. Okay, so we've just taken the turn off to Glen Ateef. I'm gonna jump out here, try and get some pictures. It is pouring rain. <laughs> it's blowing a hoolie. So I was outside for about 20 seconds. <laughs> Blue, pretty much took me off my feet there. So we've just driven from uh, into Glen Ateef Forest from the north side of Scotland. So it goes all the way down, and I think that's Glen Ateef loch just in the background there you can't really see it we have passed so much deer so much so many deer on the way here deer stags uh, little baby deer put your hand out here no, Rather than go all the way down, sort of south of Glen Ateve, we are going to now turn around, drive back through, and then just head up to Inverness. It is now half one, so it'll be a few hours to Inverness. We get home by five, six. Keep going. Have you enjoyed it, Hal? Yeah, I've loved it. Hey guys, thanks for watching the vlog. I've just realised I forgot to do an outro. I kind of half did one there. Like saying I'm gonna drive back to Inverness now and just stopped short of saying this is the end of the vlog. Anyway, a slightly new studio setup since we were in here last. Just need to find some storage for the bike. I'll get into that another time. Thanks for watching this vlog in Scotland. The weather was very tricky, so maybe didn't shoot as much as I'd hoped, but it was an awesome Christmas and lovely to show hell on the west coast of Scotland because I'm always talking about how glorious it is. Um, I'm looking forward to doing loads of stuff on this channel in 2018, playing about with different aspects and different styles of videos that I can do. So let me know what you've enjoyed so far on the channel in the comments below. If you haven't already subscribed, please do so. Plenty more to come in the future. I've got a few in the bank ready to upload. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers. Thank you.